Hey guys, this is Arkel here, and it's been a little while, um, but uh, not too many things have really sort of happened. Um, just a lot of waiting at the moment since um, <laughs> uh, most of the stuff that I've ordered has pretty much like either arrived or is still being made. Um, and the dolls that I've ordered, I don't expect to arrive until around March. So it's just kind of one of those little lull periods, and I think a lot of you other guys in the hobby too have have uh, been feeling the same way, kind of like in a little low period at the beginning of the year. Um, hasn't really kicked off yet for a lot of us. Um, but anyway, I have uh, a little bit of updates that I want to go ahead and tell you guys, as well as I want to do a actual prompt um, after this video and probably also do some sort of like my plans for the new year after this as well. But First of all, I just sort of want to do a few little updates. This shouldn't really take too long, but knowing me. Um, but anyway, as you guys can probably see here, there's a little bit of changes with these guys. Um, Panda over here, if you can see her whoop, right here. <laughs> Panda, she got um, a new wig um, from Sunny's World. Like I said I before, I had got um, two different white fur wigs, um, which I had intended to use for my Sum Centaur, Shale Centaur, little. Um, I got him two different kinds of wigs just because at the time I wasn't really sure exactly what I wanted for him. But since then I've finalized his character, um, so I know what I want for him. But anyway, so I got two white wigs, and I have officially decided that white hair is what suits Panda best. Um, so you can see here she's wearing this really short little fur wig, and I don't know if you guys know this, but I don't really like fur wigs. Um, I usually prefer synthetic wigs. Um, like previously, the only doll that I had that had a fur wig was Etzel, and that's because there is no way in hell I'd ever be able to find his type of hairstyle in anything but a fur wig, um, which is the only reason why I got one. But I don't particularly like them too much. Um, but I'm actually really, really happy with Panda's um, wig in particular. Like, it's not super huge and poofy. I mean, it's and it's not super long, which I don't really like. Well, I think a lot of times fur wigs sort of give that, um, what do they call that, like, seen hair? Um, where it's just kind of like all over the place and layered and kind of long in the front. And uh, I don't really have characters that have the type of hair, so... Um, yeah, but I'm really happy with this particular fur wig because it's really short and it fits her head really nicely and it's not poofy and I really, really like this a lot and the fibers feel really, really nice and it looks really good on her and I'm really happy with that. So she looks super cute, super boyish, but you know, she's supposed to, but she looks adorable. I really love her like this. She just looks really, really great. Um, but anyway, and so she's wearing her little outfit and she's all back in her regular clothes, not Euclid's. Um, outfit, but she looks super cute. Um, so anyway, uh, River here in the middle, not much is really different about him except for when I had made my order to Taobao to get um, the outfit for Euclid. Um, I also got this shirt, just this shirt, um, because when I made my previous order to Taobao, I actually bought the same shirt for him, intending for him to have it, but they accidentally sent me it an SD size, and like, they got everything else in my order, like, perfect. Like, I had ordered so much stuff, and that was the only thing that was wrong. So I was like, okay, I'm not going to, like, make a big deal out of it because I'm really passive. And I, unless there's a huge issue, I usually don't, like, I usually don't complain just because I'm kind of passive and easygoing that way. Unless there's, like, a majorly huge issue, I'm like, okay, whatever. One mistake out of, like, 50 is okay. I, I can deal with that. Um, but I still really wanted this shirt for him, so I went ahead and ordered it again in MSD size. And luckily, it did come in the right size this time. Um, so I'm really, really happy about that. And it's just the sort of black, lacy, sort of kind of see-through shirt, and this is exactly the kind of thing that I imagine River wearing in a sort of modern-day sense. Like, I think I've mentioned it before, but I just imagine him wearing a lot of, like, <laughs> like, black lace and leather and... Uh-huh. Um, <laughs> yeah, but anyway, so he looks super nice like that, and yeah, he looks awesome. I'm really glad that I finally had that shirt for him, so I'm wanting it forever. Um... So yeah, I just had to get that in that order, even though it was like one thing, and I'm like, ooh, one thing. Um, but anyway, and then over here, <laughs> over here you can see Faustus, and he looks quite a bit different as well. 
Um, like I said, I ordered two wigs from Sunny's World, um, both with the intention for being uh, for my Sum Centaur. Um, but obviously, he can only wear one wig at a time. Um, so Panda got one of them, and the one that Faustus is wearing right now whoop, um, is for uh, it's going to be for my Sum Centaur. And I've went ahead and styled it and stuff. You can't really see it super well. Eh, there you go. You can kind of see it. Um, if you guys like, I don't know how many of you guys like watch my drawing channel or follow my Twitter or my DeviantArt, whatever. Uh, if you do, then you know of the character that I'm talking about and you might have seen his hair by now. Um, but yeah, I've sort of finalized his design, so I finalized his hair as well. And I kind of styled it to look really similar. I can't make it exact because, yeah, I just can't. Um, the way that his hair is, it's supposed to be kind of like, kind of like, um, gelled over, like really dapper-like, like men in the 50s. Um, and I can't really do that with wigs. I don't really want to ruin them, so I don't actually want to like gel it over the way it is. And even so, like the way that his hair is supposed to be kind of like a little bit poofy. I don't know. It's hard to explain. I'm really bad with words. Um, but if you do follow my DeviantArt Twitter, whatever, um, then you know what I'm talking about because you've seen a picture of it. Um, or I can just link you a picture in the description. Uh, that'll work too if you haven't. Um, but anyway, so Faustus is modeling that. I was really dumb and I was like, you know, oh, I shouldn't touch this wig until he gets here because I don't want to mess it up. And then I was thinking to myself, oh, wait, Faustus is totally the exact same sculpt, only with half closed eyes. Derp. <laughs> I like I face palmed so hard I was like oh yeah that's right I'm pretty much gonna be having two of the same doll only with different eyes so why not just go ahead and put it on Faustus and style it now so when he gets here it'll be all done so it looks really nice on Faustus which is really good because it'll look really good on uh, my centaur version whenever he gets here um, but anyway so yeah he looks really awesome he looks really good in short hair <laughs> Too bad he's never had short hair and never will have short hair, but even so, he looks really good like that. Like, hot damn. Um, but anyway, uh, so yeah, that's pretty much it. Oh, I also, let me show you this, I also got in whoop, the eyes for my Sum Centaur. If you can see them, they have little stars. My camera's not going to focus. Woo. There you go, you can kind of see them. I don't know. My camera sucks. Um, anyway, I got those in the mail. Those are from Soul Doll, as well as I got yellow eyes for my mom's little dragon. Maybe I'll show her, you her sometime soon. Or maybe I already have. I'm not too sure. Her yellow eyes came in the mail a while ago, and so with that order, I also got eyes for my um, Steam Centaur. So that arrived. Um, I think that's about it. The only other thing that I'm sort of waiting on is that recently I ordered like four shirts, I think. I think it was four from the Sugar Doll shop on Etsy. Uh, and why I did that was because I noticed that I have a shortage of shirts. I have so many pairs of pants for my dolls, but I don't really have as many shirts. So I decided to go ahead and get some more and um, I kind of got them with the intention that they'll work out really well for my incoming Unoa because they're modeled on an Unoa doll. So I'm like, okay, they'll look really nice. Um, but also just most of my dolls just mix and match things anyway. And my Unoa, the character for that doll, will wear anything. Literally anything. So I'm like, whatever. You, I'll just put those on you and it'll be all good. Because, yeah. <laughs> but anyway, that's pretty much all that I'm waiting for. Um, I'm still waiting on a really small order from Apple Bin, but I knew that would take a long time. So that probably won't get here for maybe another month or so. I'm not too sure. But that is a-okay. It's just some jackets for... Um, Faustus and River. Oh my god, this video is nine minutes long. All right, so I'm gonna stop rambling. That's all of my updates. Now I'm gonna go ahead and do some more videos that are not about updates. So thank you guys so much for watching, and oh my god, I'm sorry I rambled too much. <laughs>